Hey guys, what's up? Tyler here with T-Game and Tech. In today's video, I'm gonna be going over the final build of Cyanage and Mod 10. And this is a pretty stable release. They call it the stable release. And so if you wanna pick it up, it is, I'll put a link in the description below where you can pick up Cyanage and Mod 10 for the Galaxy S3 at least. Uh, but if you search around on the website, you can find other builds for other different phones. And so they call this uh, the almost final release. There are a couple things with certain phones that aren't working exactly right, but 99% this is the final build. And uh, I had the October nightly build on before this, and it was starting to lag a lot. Opening up, opening up text messages was taking a couple seconds and it was just starting to slow down. Battery life was decreasing. And so I don't know if the nightly build was just kind of wearing out or if it was just expiring or it was just kind of trying to starting to clog up in the back end i don't really know what the deal was but after upgrading to the newest version i didn't do a fresh install i just upgraded to science mod 10 the final version and i will say as i just move the google google search bar i will say that it is a lot quicker than the nightly build that i had on before and i think why can't i do this and I think that it is a pretty solid update and it is definitely worth updating if you have a nightly build of Sign Engine Mod from before. And so a couple other issues I had with the nightly build from October was that sometimes the home button didn't turn on the screen. Uh, it was happened in a rare occasions, but if I hit the home button, the screen wouldn't turn on. But after using this for a couple days, I haven't ran into that problem at all. Both the home button and the power button turn on the screen. I have not had any random shutdowns. I had a few um, on the very earlier versions of Science and Mod, but it was extremely rare. Uh, maybe once or twice throughout the whole couple months that I had it, had it ever just shut off. But in the last build though, I did have the screen lock up for me a couple times. Uh, if I would lock the screen and I go to unlock it, I'd see the uh, capacitive buttons turn on and I could feel like the icons clicking the icons underneath, but the screen would just stay blank. I haven't had that issue at all with this last build. And so that's something they also fixed. So overall, I think it's a solid update. Like I said, everything's a lot quicker. I think battery life is doing better as well. A battery life, like I said, was starting to drain and starting to drag on uh, with the or earlier build. But with this final build, uh, everything seems to be working a lot better. It's a lot smoother, in my opinion. And I think it's definitely worth upgrading if you have other versions of Cyanage and Mod, either nightly builds or monthly builds. And like I said, I'll put a link in the description below where you can pick up the Galaxy S3 version. And so if you guys enjoy this video, give it a like. Uh, feel free to check out all my other videos on this channel. Remember, subscribe up top if you are not. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and subscribe. And so thank you guys for watching this video, and we'll see you guys in the next one.